Assalamualaikum and hello everyone. In this video, I am going to demonstrate experiment simple harmonic motion or its short form SHM. At the end of this video, students should be able to determine the acceleration due to gravity G using a simple pendulum and second, to investigate the effect of large amplitude oscillation to the accuracy of G obtained from the experiment. An oscillation of a simple pendulum is an example of a simple harmonic motion if the mass of the spherical bob is a point mass, the mass of the string is negligible, and the amplitude of the oscillation is small, less than 10 degree. According to the theory of SHM, the period of oscillation of a simple pendulum T is given by equation 1, where L is the length of the pendulum and G is the acceleration due to gravity. By squaring both sides of equation 1, we obtain equation 2. And by comparing equation 2 with the linear equation, then we plot a graph of T square against L and we can obtain the linear graph show, as shown. The value of G can be obtained from the gradient M equal to 4 pi square over G. By rearrange, we can find that G equal to 4 pi square over M. Operators used for this experiment are a simple pendulum. Make sure the length of the string is more than 105 cm. A retort stand with clamp, a protector, an optical pin attached to a cord, a stopwatch, a meter rule, and a G clamp or a stabilizing weight. The picture on the left is the schematic diagram of the experiment, and the picture on the right is the uh, is the side view of the experiment setup. For this experiment, first measure the length of the string, then set up the apparatus. Next, release the pendulum at an angle less than 10 degree from the vertical point. Let the pendulum oscillate. Start the stopwatch after several complete oscillations. Measure the time T for 20 oscillations. Repeat the operation and calculate the average value. Repeat the experiment for at least 5 different value of length of the pendulum. You may complete the table and plot a graph of T square against L. For the next part of the experiment, fix the length of the pendulum to 100 cm. Release the pendulum at an angle 70 degree from the vertical point. Record the time taken for 5 oscillation. Repeat the operation and calculate the average value. Calculate the value of T by dividing with 5. Tabulate your data. Lastly, Calculate the value of G by using equation 2. Once you have completed the table, write a full report. Give comment about the experimental result by comparing it with the standard value. The theoretical value for G is 9.81 meters per second square. State the source of error 
as well as any precaution taken to overcome them. Finally, state your conclusion for the experiment. Thank you for watching.